Planet Earth's great diversity of life thrives only within the thin surface layer called the biosphere. For life to flourish, we need to take care of this living skin of our world. A global network of UNESCO World Biosphere Sites are leading the way as places that balance our daily needs with those of the rest of nature. The Brighton and Lewis Downs Biosphere area spans almost 400 square kilometres of land and sea, from the River Ada in the west to the River Ouse in the east. The countryside here is part of the South Downs National Park, but our biosphere also includes the city of Brighton and Hove and county town of Lewis, as well as the coastline and sea between Shoreham and New Haven. Our biosphere is home to more than a third of a million people and receives 12 million visitors every year. Thousands of species of wildlife live here too, especially on the internationally rare downland and chalk reefs. Our area's development has always been intimately linked to the environment, underpinning the rich heritage and contemporary culture that we enjoy today. A network of green connections reach from Brighton to the surrounding South Downs National Park, out to places like the spectacular Dry Chalk Valley of Devil's Dyke. Colourful and biodiverse chalk grasslands can be found on the steep slopes all along the South Downs Way path, from where there are incredible views. The county town of Lewis nestles within a gap in the downs on the River Ouse, surrounded by chalk downland and floodplain meadows. The Ada River Valley to the west also captures floodwaters before it flows down to the tidal estuary at Shoreham-by-Sea. Nearby, Shoreham Port is an increasing focus of new development and renewable energy. The port of New Haven on the River Ouse to the east is also an area of seaborne trade and economic regeneration. The striking coastline of white chalk cliffs here is rich in fossils, with the beaches beneath hosting a treasure trove of sea creatures, perfect places for rock pooling. Below the waves, the chalk reef extends out to sea with every available surface covered in life. The undersea world here is so rich that it's now protected as one of the UK's first marine conservation zones, extending westwards as far as Brighton Marina. We all need to value, care for and sustain our world-class environment into the future. Please join us and be part of it.